Charles Law. A sample of gas has a volume of 2.80 liters at an unknown temperature. When the sample is submerged in ice water at a temperature of 0.00 degrees Celsius, its volume decreases to 2.57 liters. What was its initial temperature in Kelvin and in degrees C? In this problem, we are given information about temperature and volume. Now, Charles' law relates changes in volume to changes in temperature. So we're going to call our original volume V1 and V1 is 2.80 liter. And we're taking that volume to a volume that I call V2, which is 2.5 seven liters at a temperature T2 of 0, 0.00 degrees C. Now what we're asked to find is what was the original temperature. So we want to find T1 both in Kelvin and degree Celsius. So to solve this problem we are going to employ Charles law. And Charles law says that that the ratio of the initial volume over the initial temperature will be equal to the final volume over the final temperature. So We'll solve this for the initial temperature. T1 is equal to V1 times T2 divided by V2. Now we have to remember, whenever using any of the gas laws, that the temperature must be in kelvins. So before we plug in, we want to convert the temperature to, to kelvins. So T2 is our original 0. 0, 0 degrees C and to that we're going to add 273.15 which gives us just 273.15 K so now we can substitute in and solve for the temperature. T1 is equal to our initial volume, 2.80 liter times T2, 2 73.15 K and 
and this is divided by our volume 2 which is 2.57 liters so liters cancel and we're left with an answer in kelvins so our initial temperature in kelvins is 297.6 k but we realize that we are restricted to three significant digits This answer must be rounded to three significant figures due to the limitations imposed by our data. So in terms of Kelvins, T1 is equal to 298K. When converting this to degree C, we'll maintain these all these digits to avoid Randolph error. So we're going to subtract 273.15 with the understanding that we need to round off to three significant digits which means that our final answer is going to be 24 degrees C. Now we should check to make sure that our answer makes sense. Our volume went from 2.80 liters to 2.57 liters. That's a decrease in volume. We know that a decrease in volume is caused by a lowering of temperature. So if our final temperature was zero, our beginning temperature must be greater than that. So 24 degrees C is a logical answer.